so in this video let us cover some more string methods one is so concat and this is a method which is used by a string so this shows a certain behavior like it is going to take these many number of strings so at first let me read this what this concat does so concat concat is going to take these many strings string 2 string 3 up to this string and so string 1 is going to be this string which is going to use this concat here is some example let a string 1 equals to this hello and another string variable is world and you can observe here string 1 is using this method or a string function and this is going to take as it is shown that its syntax is in this form like taking these many inputs so I just pro here it has provided the space and after that this string 2 so string 1 plus string 2 plus this variable so that is how we can use this concat and let's understand some more examples so let's assume I'm just going to create some kind of string like some game score and after that we have this thing and after that set them space and there will be some score right here so this is the space so so to clear this I'm going to provide I'm just going to take all this thing in a single string like string 1 and this space as string 2 and this school is also going to be the third string so string 3 so that is the plan and now let us execute that so I'm using this let keyword so string 1 will be this game score and string 2 is as I said it is a space and this string 3 is this score and that score has to be some number let this be 0 and now so this comes at the first place you can observe here this string 1 is present at the beginning and after that we have string 2 and then string 3 so let the let us create a string for which is going to store all this value so at the first place we have this string 1 so this comes at the first place and after that string 2 comes at the second place or we can use this concord method so instead of this let's use this concat so string 1 comes at the first place since this is a string it can use and after that it will take string 2 
and then string 3 so that its final result will be this has to be capital and some space because of this string 2 and string 3 is 0 so this is the final value and this is how we can use this concat now let's use this includes so even these names are quite easier to remember what this method does since its name is includes it is going to take search string add set and this position so right here we have this example like string equals to this thing console.log is to show the output and that output is that is going to be this thing so string str as it is a string it is going to use this method and this is going to check whether this small w world is present here or not so this world is present so its output is true and let us do some more and another example is it is shown here here it has provided a capital w which shows a false so it is a case sensitive let's take an example let's suppose we have a string and this is equals to small a b and this c this is just going to show our the terminal so since this is a string this is going to use this includes method or some kind of function for this string so because of that we have this dot operator right here at first we need to make sure that this has to be a string and after that you can use this method or the function of this string so I'm just going to check whether this B is present or not so it is going to show true because this small B is present right here and let's suppose we have you suppose I want to show to show I'm going to use this console.log and I'm going to search by using this includes method whether this capital B is present or not so capital B is not present in this string so this will be false so these are the examples how we can use this include methods and so in the upcoming videos I am going to provide some more things about these kind of string methods and until then see you again and keep a healthy life.